Hello, all my snowflakes. Okay, so the day is finally here. If you guys are following my Instagram, you know I've been teasing a new cosplay for a while. And she finally came today. I'm kind of branching out of the Disney princesses. Those will always be my main girls, but we're going Marvel. So, first of all, I'm going to show you guys the wig that I got for this. It's so pretty. It's from Wig is Fashion, and it's a lace front um, I guess a ginger, reddish, blondish, I don't know, but it's so pretty. Obviously, it's nice and wavy. It looks gorgeous, and I got a little overzealous when I originally was trimming the lace on this, because you can't tell, but I trimmed the lace down here a little too much and cut off some of the actual hair on the wig. <laughs> Whoopsies. <laughs> and I will link every, all the pieces to this cosplay in the description. She is so gorgeous. And then for the cosplay, I got this all from Cosrea, I think. Yeah. So the same place I got my coronation on a cosplay. So we got the Scarlet Witch. Oh, oh, oh dear. Okay. So here's the top i like how the armor is one piece and it's kind of got that little shiny look to it now i thought this was going to have gloves and it looks like it doesn't maybe they're attached to the shirt i don't know and then it is a zip up back and then it has her belt on the back that attaches with velcro at least i think it velcros yes and i like this material it's it's kind of knit almost really let's get this closer to the camera so you can see it's not quilted but it kind of looks like it could be quilted. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, you can kind of see it. Looks really cool. And I guess eh, I'll figure those arms out when I actually go to put it on. So this front part of her armor is like pleather almost, I think. And then it's got detailing going down the back here, which I really love. And then I think it's because of the way it was in packaging. The ends of the belt on this are trying to curl inward a bit, so I'll have to fix that when I'm wearing it. And that's got her little belt symbol thing. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Okay, and then I got the version that came with her cape. And this is the Wanda version, um, WandaVision finale version, so it's not Doctor Strange. So let me stand up. So this is the outside of it, and it's got the, like, ragged edges almost, which I really like that. And then, well, actually, I'm sorry, this is the inside. And then this is the outside. It's kind of got that gradient dark to the really pretty red. And then it's got the red at the, or the goes back to dark at the bottom. I love that. And then it just velcros around the neck. And then the pants, there's nothing really special about these. They're just stretchy pants. Oh, oh, that's a bounce. They're stretchy pants that have kind of the same material as the shirt. And I thought maybe they had pockets. It looks like they do not. That's okay. And oh, it's one of those pants where you can't tell which is the front and which is the back. Oh well. And let's see if I... If they do go down a little bit, 
past my feet, but having the boots on, which I'll show you guys in a minute, that shouldn't be an issue. And then here are the boots. There's nothing really special about them at all. I've got a little bit of the heel. And the nice thing is, Cross Rayon included these no extra charge. Which I thought was nice. And they're leather. They've got that same pattern that was on the shirt and pants. Looks really cool. And then the boots themselves are kind of oddly shaped, but that's alright. And these are supposed to be a size 8. So we'll see if they fit. And then, of course, the most iconic part. The headdress. I feel like this is not going to stick to my face real well. Like, oh, well, maybe it will. I don't know. No, it's not going to. It's going to stick out. So I may have to do double-sided tape or something on the inside of this to get it to stick. But it's got an elastic band, so it just fits around your head. It is kind of flimsy, but I like how textured it looks. Like, it looks like it's really old. Oh, this is gonna look incredible. I am so happy. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna go put all this on and come back and show you guys how it looks. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm going to warn you guys, this isn't as good as I thought it was going to be, but we're just going to roll with it. And I did have a slight wardrobe malfunction, but I fixed it, and I'll explain what happened in just a second. All right, so, grand reveal in three, two, one. Boom. Now, I don't really like the headdress, because it looks good off, and then as soon as I put it on, it, like, stretched out really weird. So I may have to, like tape it or something to get it to stick where I want it but other than that I adore this wig it looks so good and then the cape you guys know me I'm a sucker for anything with a cape honestly so and then I guess the gloves are attached to the The gloves are attached to the sleeves, which I don't quite know how to feel about that, but it's okay. Okay, right, so what happened is, when I went to zip up the shirt, the actual, um, what's the word I'm looking for? The little part of the zipper that goes into the base of the zipper actually broke off. And then when I went to pull the zipper up, it did that thing where the uh, two sides of the zipper aren't even, so it wasn't zipping up all the way. I was able to fix it, so crisis averted. And these boots, thank goodness this is more of a TikTok outfit because these boots hurt like heck. I, ugh. Maybe I have them on the wrong beat. I don't know. I, it looked like I had them right, but maybe I don't. So, let me pull the cape off. Now, at the moment, I don't really like how the collar is, like, sticking up as it is, but I know it's because of the material that the armor itself is made out of. And then the wings or whatever actually attach to the shirt so it's all one piece I have to keep going it down I like this the only thing is it's gonna be more of like a fall winter type outfit cuz this is way hot <laughs> but I like how it looks and oh it's gonna look so good in pictures I am so ready. I just may need to get a better headdress and possibly get rid of this one because, I mean, I like it, but it does that weird thing where it stretches out. And I tried putting it 
over the wig, which actually made it worse. So I tried pulling the wig out and putting it like under where the headdress is and it's still. See, that's how it should look. Not like little batters, I don't know. But, uh, but other than that, I love, love, love this outfit. I feel so cool. And let me show you guys the boots on just for the heck of it. Ow, I gotta get these things off like yesterday. So there's the boots and then I tucked the pants into them. I don't think I'm going to be able to keep these. Because they're not very good quality, but it's okay. It's mainly an outfit for TikToks anyways. And if I need to, I have a pair of... Um, wedge boots with heels that I can wear with this and they'll still look pretty much the same. Okay, so overall I'd give this mm, I'm gonna say an 8 out of 10 because I feel like maybe if my head wasn't so big or if I had taken the time to like flatten my hair to my head, which I really didn't, I just kind of shoved it in the wig cap and threw it on Maybe the headdress wouldn't stretch out so much. And I feel like with wearing it, this part will flatten out. And then the rest of it just takes some getting used to. But I feel pretty badass in this. Oh, I didn't even show you guys the, the cape. I mean, I did, but I didn't show you the back of it, like, on me. So, give me, like... Two seconds. Alright, so there's the cape. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay. Alright, so now that that's all done. I'm going to scoot and get out of all this and go take a nap because I just came home from work and I am tired. I love all you little uh, Sokovians, I guess. Because I can't say snowflakes because I'm Wanda. But, oh well. And I'll see all of you in the next video. Always remember to spread a little chaos magic. See you soon. Okay, so I am a total idiot. This wasn't a cape, this was the skirt. No wonder it felt kind of weird. So it's supposed to be, okay. Oh, that looks much better now. Okay, I'm, I'm done. Roast me in the comments, that's fine. <laughs> I deserve that. I could have sworn I ordered the version that came with the cape though, so I'm not sure, but this is obviously the skirt. It looks so much better now. Okay, now that I cleared that up. Skirt, not cape. Alright, I'm gonna go now. Love all you guys. Bye. Hello again, all my snowflakes. Okay, so editing me back again. I realized after I filmed that whole video, <clears throat> when I was looking at the Casareo website, they accidentally sent me the Multiverse of Madness Wanda costume, which is pretty much the same but there are some differences so that's why I wasn't as enthused with the costume I got because it wasn't the one I wanted and I didn't realize that in the moment but after checking on their website it was the multiverse of madness outfit so I emailed Cosrea I'm gonna try to get the version that I actually ordered it'd be nice if they let me keep the multiverse of madness one because it's kind of grown on me but we'll see how that goes so, if that's, or if I seem kind of confused and kind of out of it in this video, that's why. And plus, I was trying to get the video filmed quickly and get out of all my stuff. Because my mom was giving me a bit of a bad time. But, yeah. So, that's what happened. I'll keep you guys updated if I get the actual costume I ordered or if I have to send the old one back. I really hope not. We'll see. Okay, love you.